this is my review for Soul Calibur 5, 4. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, Soul Calibur 4 is a great 3D fighting game. There's there's a good amount of modes in this game. There's story, arcade, training, versus, descent, and ascend. Descent is like a survival tag team mode where you use your creative character or your normal characters. You put parts of them, make them stronger, faster, all kind of customization parts for various different gameplay types. And then there's the ascend mode where it's like a Mortal Kombat mode with tower mode, D different objectives. Like get five hit combos, knock this person off the ring, throw somebody, etc. The story mode, which consists of five fights and the character ending. And there's the arcade mode, which get the best score and best time when you fight the boss. Create a character mode is great. Museum mode or glory mode. A good amount of modes in here, even though it's not a lot. I say Soul Calibur 2, 3, or 1. But it's a good amount of modes. The gameplay is fast, complex, easy to get into. They kind of dumbed it down in Soul Calibur 5. Now, the online play on this game, it's, it's okay. I've seen better online play, such as Super Street Fighter 4, or even King of Fighters 13. Yeah, but the online play, if, if, if it isn't slowing down, then it's struggling with your command, like it'll do a second late. Well, for me, anyways. Overall, though, I would give Soul Calibur 4 an, an 8.5. It would get a 9, but it would have to have just a little more modes, and the online should be better. But it does the job of being a great Soul Calibur game. The intro, it's alright. That seems better to the other Soul Calibers. But I like this intro. Better than, say, Soul Calibur 5's intro. Well, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. And by the way, the online play on Soul Calibur 5 is definitely better than the online play on this game. Soul Calibur 5 has wonderful online play. Alright, thanks for watching.